Welcome back. I'm going to do a quick review of what we've already done. These are the front panels here. I've got the front front yoke, the front bib panel yoke, the bib panel facings, mid uh, mid panel, uh, outside outside front panel. Everything is stitched up, and of course these are all rough edges. Uh, as I said before, this this whole this whole process is is my practice run. And I want to bring your attention, again, this is going to be a corrective actions uh, video. These, uh, the pillow lines that you see going across the, the front yoke here, those are exactly six eighths uh, of an inch. Now, I have no idea what I did wrong or what I was reading because on the back yoke, and I'll bring this into frame, as you can see here on the back yoke, these quilt lines are much more narrow than the ones that you'd find on the front yoke. One of the parts of the instructions clearly says that these quilt lines, once constructed with the, the, front, the front panels, would align. Now, when I did this and I put this together, I couldn't understand what I did wrong, but now I do. So that being said, corrective action, make sure that uh, the back yoke quilt lines are six eighths of an inch. So I'm going to attach the, uh, the front panels to the rear panel. We're going to be sewing along the shoulder seams. And again, it calls for the three quarters, three quarters of an inch seam allowance. And of course that matches up with the three quarters of an inch seam allowance on the back yoke as well. There we are, we have two front yokes, or I should say the two front panels pinned to the back panel. We'll move on to the machine. There we are, and that's complete. So we've got the front panel and the back panel sewn together at the shoulders. I'm very happy with the way that the seams turned out. I'm going to roll this in. I think you can definitely get a good look at that. Nice and tight, nice and even. Uh, just as an extra precaution, uh, on the corners, I did some zigzag stitching. So at the very end on the inside, just did doot, 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 right across there. I just wanted to reinforce that. I think that, you know, from the, around the neck corner and the arm scythe corner, those are probably some weak links. I wanted to firm those up. Again, I'd love to hear from you. Please leave a comment. If you have a suggestion, please give me some constructive feedback. If you're certainly much more skilled than I am and you have, you have knowledge to share, please do so. That's why I'm making this. Once again, thanks very much. My name is Jeremy. Bye for now.